The relentless drumbeat of the U.S.-China tech war often echoes with pronouncements of insurmountable barriers. China can't build cutting-edge AI chips, declared Western voices citing the chokehold on advanced EUV lithography equipment. Yet, in a move resonating like a calculated counteroffensive, Huawei has unveiled a technological tour de force that doesn't merely circumvent the blockade. It seemingly vaults over it. Welcome to our channel your ultimate source for groundbreaking tech innovations and the future of artificial intelligence. If you're obsessed with AI chip technology, Huawei competitors, or the next big thing in artificial intelligence, this video is for you. Before we dive in, smash that like button if you're excited about Huawei breakthroughs. Today, we're diving into one of the hottest topics in 2025, China's Silicon Gambit. Huawei's multi-chip masterstroke reshapes the AI battlefield. The weapon? an audacious quad-chip packaging technology wielding existing manufacturing capabilities to forge a silicon behemoth propelling its Ascend 910D AI processor into the performance stratosphere. This isn't just another chip iteration. It's a fundamental reimagining of computational density. At its heart lies a monolithic slab of silicon, a staggering 2,660 square millimeters, dwarfing conventional processors. Within this expanse, Huawei engineers have masterfully integrated four distinct AI compute dies. Think of it not as a single brain, but as four powerful minds working in seamless, hyperconnected concert. This multi-chip module approach represents a paradigm shift, leveraging sophisticated packaging as the new frontier for performance gains, particularly potent in an era where Moore's law scaling faces immense physical and geopolitical friction. The packaging alchemy, turning constraints into catalysts. Faced with the denial of ASML's EUV machines needed for sub-7 NM mass production, Huawei turned necessity into the mother of disruptive invention. Instead of chasing the bleeding-edge single-die node shrink, currently dominated by TSMC and Samsung for players like NVIDIA and AMD, Huawei focused its formidable R&D on maximizing the potential of China's established manufacturing base, primarily SMIC's reliable 14 nanometers and improving 7 nanometers processes. Their breakthrough lies in the intricate quad-chip packaging technology. This involves homogeneous dye integration, utilizing four identical Ascend compute cores manufactured on SMIC's available nodes. This sidesteps the yield challenges and astronomical costs often associated with pushing to the absolute limits of a single, massive die. Advanced interconnect fabric. The true magic resides in the ultra-high bandwidth, ultra-low latency interconnect woven between these four dies. Huawei's proprietary technology ensures data flows between them as if they were a single, unified processor core, minimizing communication overhead that traditionally plagues multi-chip designs. This interconnect density and efficiency are critical to unlocking the claimed performance leap. 2.5D slash 3D packaging expertise. The technology likely employs sophisticated 2.5D or early 3D stacking techniques. This allows the densely packed dyes to communicate directly through microscopic pathways within the interposer or vertically through silicon vias vastly surpassing the bandwidth limitations of traditional circuit boards. Performance unleashed, the Ascend 910D Silicon Beast. The results, as claimed by Huawei, are nothing short of explosive. By distributing the AI computational workload across four optimized cores connected via their high-speed fabric, the Ascend 910D achieves a generational performance jump estimated at 300% compared to its predecessor, or comparable single-die designs on similar process nodes. This translates directly into faster AI model training times and more complex model handling. Complementing the quad-core design is the integration of 16 groups of cutting-edge, domestically produced high-bandwidth memory. HBM stacks memory dies vertically, connected via TSVs, providing unparalleled bandwidth crucial for feeding data-hungry AI algorithms. This dense memory subsystem ensures the powerful compute cores are rarely starved for data, maximizing utilization and overall system throughput. This combination pushes the compute density, performance per unit area or volume, to unprecedented levels for a Chinese-designed chip. 
The reliance on mature 14 nanometers per 7 nanometers processes, coupled with potentially higher yield from smaller individual dyes compared to a single monolithic dye of equivalent complexity, reportedly slashes manufacturing costs by up to 40%. This economic advantage is a critical weapon in the commercial AI battlefield. The significance of Huawei's achievement extends far beyond raw technical specifications. It embodies a strategic masterstroke with profound geopolitical implications. By innovating at the packaging and architectural level, Huawei has demonstrated a viable path to high performance that deliberately sidesteps the most stringent U.S. export controls focused on EUV lithography and the most advanced sub 7NM fabrication technologies. The design, packaging, and integration are touted as entirely domestic. The successful utilization of SMIX 14 nanometers and 7 nanometers processes for such a high performance product is a major vote of confidence in China's leading foundry. It proves that significant performance gains can be extracted from these nodes through clever design and packaging, reducing immediate pressure to match TSMC's 3 nanometers or 2 nanometers capabilities head on. Claims that the Ascend 910D, powered by this quad die packaging and domestic HBM, can now challenge or even outperform established competitors in specific AI training workloads sent a shockwave through the industry. The notion that mature node chips, supercharged by packaging innovation, can rival the performance of cutting-edge single-die designs on 3 nanometers or 4 nanometers processes fundamentally disrupts the traditional performance hierarchy dictated solely by process node shrinkage. It forces competitors to reevaluate their own roadmaps, accelerating investment in advanced packaging across the board. Beyond the technical specs, this development serves as a potent symbol for China's broader, Xin Shuang strategy, emphasizing self-reliance and indigenous innovation. It demonstrates an ability to adapt, innovate under pressure, and develop unique solutions when conventional paths are blocked. Headlines proclaiming NVIDIA panics capture the visceral reaction but oversimplify a complex dynamic. NVIDIA, under Jensen Huang's leadership, is deeply aware of the packaging revolution. Its own GPUs, like the Blackwell series, heavily leverage advanced packaging and multi-die architectures. NVIDIA's lead in AI software and system-level integration remains formidable. However, Huawei's breakthrough undeniably intensifies the competition. If the Ascend 910D delivers on its performance claims, particularly in cost-performance metrics, it becomes a highly attractive option for cost-sensitive or domestically focused AI projects within China and potentially in other markets less aligned with U.S. restrictions. This directly erodes NVIDIA's market dominance in its largest growth sector. Global players, wary of geopolitical disruptions, may see Huawei's success as evidence that viable alternatives to the traditional U.S. Taiwan Korea's semiconductor axis are emerging, potentially encouraging diversification efforts. Huawei's rhetoric points squarely at the next generation of AI leadership. Mentioning Rubin Ultra frames the Ascend 910D as the opening salvo in a direct assault on the AI performance crown by 2026. This sets the stage for an unprecedented technological arms race where packaging innovation, architectural brilliance, and software optimization will be as critical as the underlying transistor size. While revolutionary, Huawei's path is not without significant hurdles. Mass-producing such large, complex multi-die packages with high yield is a monumental challenge. Interposer defects, bonding failures, and thermal management complexities at scale could impact cost and availability. Packing immense computational power into a dense package generates tremendous heat. Dissipating this heat efficiently is critical for sustained performance and system reliability, a challenge potentially magnified compared to more spread out monolithic designs. Raw hardware power is only part of the equation. NVIDIA's dominance rests heavily on CUDA and its vast software ecosystem. Huawei needs to continue aggressively building out its MindSpore framework and developer community to fully leverage its hardware advances. The U.S. is unlikely to stand still. Export controls could potentially adapt to target advanced packaging technologies or specific materials and tools used in their production, creating new obstacles. Huawei's quad-chip packaging innovation is far more than a technical achievement. It is a strategic inflection point. 
it forcefully demonstrates that the trajectory of computational advancement is no longer solely dictated by the relentless shrinking of transistors. In an era constrained by physics and geopolitics, innovation in chip integration, how we connect and orchestrate existing silicon, has emerged as a powerful, disruptive force. By leveraging sophisticated packaging to extract performance, rivaling cutting-edge nodes for mature manufacturing processes, Huawei hasn't just caught up. It has potentially rewritten the rulebook for a significant segment of the high-performance computing market, particularly within the strategic AI domain. It validates China's capacity for deep technological innovation under pressure and provides a tangible blueprint for semiconductor self-reliance. The claim that sanctions merely force Huawei to build a more powerful bomb finds potent evidence in this silicon behemoth. The Ascend 910D, with its four hearts beating in unison and fueled by domestic HBM, is a stark declaration that China is not just participating in the AI race, but is actively forging its own path to the summit. The battle lines for AI supremacy in 2026 and beyond have been dramatically redrawn, with advanced packaging now firmly established as a critical, if not decisive, battleground. The reverberations of this silicon gambit will be felt across boardrooms and government agencies worldwide for years to come. If this video blew your mind, hit like, share it with your tech crew, and subscribe. Don't forget that bell icon to stay in the loop. Thanks for watching, and let's keep pushing the boundaries of tech together.